food desert is an area that's geographically defined by the USDA as not having access to fresh produce. In New Jersey alone, 1.2 million people are food insecure. Nationally, 49 million people are food insecure. For many of the folks, if not all of them, that are coming out today, this might be the only opportunity for them to be able to get hold of any fresh fruits and vegetables. For many of them, it's the first time they've ever stepped foot on the farm. They're going to come out to be part of the process. All right, we're ready to rock and roll, everybody? Yeah. Awesome. So here's what we're going to do, everybody. We're going to take wonderful green romaine lettuce with some beautiful peppers, and that is going to go to your free farm market tomorrow. Yeah. All right. <laughs> now, with corn, you want to make sure that the base is really thick. Very excited. Never been to see a farm before. I love lettuce. At the end of the day, what they're going to walk away with is not just produce. They're going to walk away with a sense of pride. Got a corn. This is exactly right. Got it. They're giving an opportunity to give back. <laughs> to say, hey, I made a difference today. And that's really what it's all about. It's all together working to help those folks who are faced with hunger. The best thing was getting to pick the corn because we had to use a lot of strength and it was fun. I wish that me and my family ran a farm in my backyard and we had a lot of fresh fruits and vegetables to help the community. So we're constantly asked, you know, why wouldn't you sell produce? And everyone thinks we're crazy. The only way that we get revenue is through donations and that's individuals, it's private foundations or corporate foundations. We want everything that comes off this property to go to people who need it the most. It's good. When, when you look at our incredible volunteers, a pool of 4,000 people just really makes this whole thing click. It's a great group. Grow started back in 2002. Good job. And from that little 30 by 30 foot garden, we donated 120 pounds that year. But fast forward to 1.2 million pounds last year alone. And then 3.7 million pounds since we started the program. People know they're making a huge difference. That's what drives us. There you go. It used to be a, a, a hobby. It used to be a nice little project. So here's what we're going to do. But there are so many different agencies and people throughout the state of New Jersey who are reliant on what we do. People in Jersey City really appreciate Grow the Row. We're going to eat healthy this week. We got some romaine lettuce. I think we have a little corn. They bring all these fresh produce and they give it out for free. I mean, who, who does that these days? <laughs> and Grow the Rope actually came out here and helped us build this community garden. It feels awesome. The vegetables that I took out and put into these boxes are now free. You have a great day now. Chip, he's a nice guy. <laughs> Can you say Caesar salad? Because <laughs> some people don't have vegetables and he's trying to share so they can be healthy too. What we're doing here is not just a nice thing, it's a necessity. It's changed my life, it's changed my family's life. It's a great feeling. I wouldn't give it up for the world. <laughs>